Another nice feature in Safari is Reading List. It's represented here in the sidebar with its own tab. Reading List lets you store web pages that you want to come back to later, but don't necessarily want to bookmark permanently. If I go to an article on cbssports.com, I can save this into my reading list with a click up on the share button and then reading list. That moves the article under the reading list tab over in the sidebar. Let's go to espn.com and add another article to the reading list. We can also do this from the bookmarks menu or with a keyboard shortcut, shift command D. Now I can come back to these pages whenever I want and read the full articles with a click on them here in the reading list. Right click on an article in the reading list and we can save it for offline viewing. So if I'm about to board a flight or head somewhere that I'm not going to be connected to the internet, I can download the full article in reading list first. When you're finished with a reading list item, right click on it to either mark it as read or remove it from the list. That brings us to reader view. For most news articles, blog posts, or even a lot of web pages that are mainly text-based, we can use Reader View to focus on the content that we actually want to see on the page. On both of these pages, we have a lot of extra ads, links, embedded social media posts that all interrupt the article. Up in the Smart Search bar, a Reader button appears for both these pages. Click and the article content is turned into an easy to follow black on white page of text. Depending on how the page is designed, there can still be links and images visible in Reader View that apply to the article, but not so many ads and additional pieces of clutter. To get back to the original page, just click on the Reader button again or just click somewhere off the page. It's also possible to use the shortcut Shift-Command-R to toggle Reader View on and off. Remember that Reader View is not going to be available on every page. On the ESPN.com homepage, there's no Reader View option up in the search field. And there shouldn't be since this isn't a single article, post, or story. When I do click on one of the stories available from the home page, the Reader View button is then available up in the Smart Search field. 